Yannick, congratulations on your move and welcome to Leicester City. How do you feel right now? Um, I'm very happy, uh, very motivated. Um, uh, I've had a very warm welcome, both from staff and coaching staff, players, uh, the ones I've seen so far. So, yeah, I'm very excited. It's a special club that's done very well over the over a, a, a couple of seasons, not just a couple of seasons, really, but, but many years now. And um, um, I think the project is 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 very, very um, uh, exciting, even from the outside looking in. So to be part of it is, uh, yeah, it's a, it's a big thing for me. It's clear from what you're saying that Brendan Rodgers is obviously a, a very big fan of yours. Have you had a chance then to to speak to him yet today or, or in the past week or so? Yes, I've I've, I've had a talk, um, had talks with him and, and, and spoke with him today as well um, when I got here. And uh, I am a, I'm a fan of how he uh, how he his teams play and how Leicester have played the last couple of years. And and I believe that I have qualities that can that can help the team. Um, and I just look forward to evolving, become a better player um, under his. Um, um, guide, uh, guiding. Um, I, uh, I, I, I'm, I'm 29, but I'm, I'm not at the, at the, the end of my development. I hope, and um, I've not never felt better. So I think it's a, it's a great pair. It's obviously been a very busy day for you today so far, but I'm sure you've had a chance to have a, a real look around here. What have you made of the facilities? World class. Uh, not seen anything like it, really, to be honest. Um, it's very, very impressive. And I think one thing is the is the facility, but um, it's also filled with with passionate people. Is my is my first impression, both in in the team and and the and the team around the team. So so right now I'm I'm, I'm very impressed by everything, and and it's just a feeling of of uh, of, of one big team. Um, family maybe even um i still have to to experience that firsthand but that's the the first impression that i get and i think that comes from from owners through the 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 board and the the managers and players and staff so so it's uh it's been quite some day you've spoken already that you've been impressed by what leicester have been able to achieve in in the past couple of seasons in particular and and coming off the back of the FA Cup win, the Community Shield win, I'm sure you'll share the same hunger that these players have to go on and win even more trophies here. It's a big motivation for me. Um, I think winning trophies is, is is something that every player is uh, is dreaming of, and 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 I'm no different. Um, I've not had the the luck yet to to achieve um, anything like like Leicester have in just in recent weeks and recent months. Um, not not even talking about the, the, the championship that the club won uh, some years ago. Um, so, so that is a big motivation as well. Um, but I'll be working in the small stuff every day, just try to help the team. And, and I think what this club has proven is that it's a, it's a team effort. It's not not just any one particular player it's a it's 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 a team effort and I'd like to be part of that team in terms of settling in here <clears throat> I can imagine it'll be fairly easy for you obviously you've got Casper and, and Ryan has made the same move that you've made this summer as well yeah uh, I know a, a, a couple of them like you say Casper and, and Ryan I know very well um and I get along with them uh, off the pitch as well so so that's going to be be very easy I think but just from my first impression, the guys there in the dressing room, they're they're, they're a good bunch of guys, and and I'm and I'm sure that I will settle in uh, very quickly. What has Casper told you about the club? Um, he hasn't really had to to sell it to me over the last couple of weeks because he's he's been going on about this club for for all the years I've known him. Um, every time we're with the national team, he has he has something good to say about his club or its people. So it's 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 not been a sales pitch that um, maybe uh, um, deliberately, but but he's always um, 
spoken very highly of, of, of everything in and around. So, I mean, he's been here for what, 10 years now. So that speaks for itself, I think. Um, but, but he only has obviously good things to say. You may just have to get used to Jamie Vardy saying Danish friends a lot. Yeah, um, I, I wasn't aware what that was referring to before I got here, but then I, I did. I, I watched uh, watched in between us and uh, tried to um, to understand the the culture. And it's a. I think it's a. It's it's a fun clip, but um, I'm just happy I don't have to play him. <laughs>